Today I'm going to groom a Shih Tzu. It will be a little unusual dog haircut. This Shih Tzu is a charming girl and has a wonderful character. She always has such a cute and funny facial expression during grooming. If you want to see the instruments and care products I've used for this grooming, please click pause when you see a pop-up sign. She is a very gentle and kind dog, and I adore her. For bathing Shih Tzu, I'm using Super Cleansing Shampoo Chris Christensen Smart Wash. It washes away all the dirt really well. After this shampoo, I always use a moisturizing shampoo on the dog's body. I like shampoo Artero Hydratante for pets. This super cleansing shampoo can make the skin dry, so I'm hydrating the dog's body. This Shih Tzu is six years old and she loves to walk a lot. So I'm using the conditioner Chris Christensen Spectrum One for hydration and volume. It gives extra protection for the dog's coat. However, I'm washing only the Shih Tzu's head with a super cleansing shampoo. This makes it easy for me to give her a beautiful head haircut because the coat is perfectly clean. The Shih Tzu has a thick coat. I'm using a compressor to dry the dog's coat faster. I'm drawing the paws of the Shih Tzu against the grain to make a lot of volume. This dog walks a lot in the woods and parks, so I'm giving her a comfortable and not long Shih Tzu haircut. I'm using Blade Andis 4 FC. I'm doing it in the same direction as her hair grows. Grooming the dog against the grain can change the direction of hair growth. I always choose a haircut for Shih Tzu according to their lifestyle and home care. I'm shaving paw pads with a Wall Super Trim Trimmer. I'm doing a not quite ordinary paws haircut. I'm removing the coat at the bottom of the paws to make it easier for the owner to care for them after long walks. I'm doing it with a Blade Andis number no. 7. I'm using rounded scissors Freelander for edging of the paws. I'm shaping beautiful columns on the Shih Tzu legs with the straight scissors Guybe Black Pearl 6 inch. I'm shaving neatly and gently on the bridge of her nose and lips with a trimmer to make her face more expressive. This Shih Tzu has very beautiful long eyelashes. Wasn't she wonderful? I'm shaving the Shih Tzu's head round. I'm using straight scissors, Swordex 9 inches, Rose Line 8 inches, Guy Black Pearl 6 inches, and Chanker Pupple Dragon 9 inches for Shih Tzu's head haircut.
I'm using thinning scissors Yanto Prime 6 inches to make a natural cut at the edges of the coat. I'm using short rounded scissors Freelander to create a voluminous and beautiful cap on the pet's head. If I want to make a voluminous head, I always use straight or rounded scissors. These scissors cut the length of the coat but don't reduce the volume, and thinning scissors reduce the length and volume of the coat. I leave long ears for this Shih Tzu. It will make her even cuter. I'm cutting Shih Tzu's ears with straight scissors. And this adorable baby has already got a haircut and is waiting for her owners. I'm making an unusual tail for this Shih Tzu. Her tail will look like a feather. This tail cut is very suitable for Shih Tzu dogs. After all, they proudly wear their tail and wave it cheerfully. To create such a tail, I'm using straight scissors, Swordex, nine inches. And hit the like button or leave a comment below. It will help my channel and the most interesting is yet to come.